looks so beautiful. <laughs> Ready to do this? I'm ready. Oh, Are you ready? Yeah, it's just my allergies. <laughs> this is a very special place for us, and my dad would have been so happy. Max. There's nothing I'm more proud of than how much we've grown together over the last six and a half years. We started out as my hot neighbor <laughs> and have turned into my best friend, my biggest supporter, my rock, and the ultimate Addy Daddy. You've really taught me what true love looks like. You show up for me, you prioritize me, and you make me feel seen and heard and safe. Nobody makes me laugh or roll my eyes harder than you do. <laughs> As your wife, I promise to do the same things for you. I'll be on your team forever. I'll love you in good times and bad without reservation. Your needs will become my needs and I'll give you the best of myself. I'll be honest with you, I'll cherish with you, and I'll ground myself in these promises when things feel hard. I promise to look forward and to always work toward growth and depth with you. And I'll do my best to keep Saturdays in the fall open for Penn State football. <laughs> I love your passion, your gentle spirit, and your dedication to doing what's right. I feel so thankful for the life that we've built, and I can't wait to see all that comes to us in the future. You make me better every day, and I promise to love you forever. <laughs> I could kiss you now. Starting to feel like myself again. Hearing forward motion, talking it over. Standing on two feet again. When I look back nearly seven years ago, I think about how our story began. I was just starting a new chapter in Chicago trying to figure out my post-grad life. There are many thoughts that come to mind as I reflect upon that first year, but none stronger than the first time I saw you in the hallway of 1645. Even after all these years, I remember that moment like it was yesterday. I remember thinking how beautiful you are and you're still the most beautiful thing in my life. And I feel so lucky every day. As I think through the key moments in our life, can't help but think the same nerves that I had on the day I brought you flowers and was shaking to ask you if you'd be my girlfriend. You may not know this, but it was that moment that I knew it'd be forever. The time since then has been the best years of my life. Our life together feels like a story to me, with many different chapters and milestones. The last time I was here was actually a year and a half ago. Um, it was actually during my grandpa spending his final days out here. And honestly, I never thought I'd be out here again. Um, but given all the curveballs 2020 did end up giving us, I mean, here we are today. And honestly, my family said it so well when they talked about this being such a special place to us. But getting to know Michelle and Michelle's family, it's not just a special place to us. This state is such a special place to them as well. And so I think that's why it feels so unique for us to be out here. And it really feels like we should have been here all along. As we begin the next chapter, I feel like we're starting a new story. A story of our lives and our family continuing to grow. I love you, Michelle and Martin. And I will continue to love you for the rest of our lives. You're my best friend. And I am so blessed to share this journey with you. I'll never forget the way you looked at me. I could.
could never forget the way you look at me.